I have seen things that nightmares are made of. Do you believe in ghosts? following footage you are about to see is raw, unscripted footage of a paranormal investigation of an alleged haunted location by the Southern Indiana ghost hunters. Any evidence, if any, that is found within this footage is the interpretation of the Southern Indiana ghost hunters, but may not be the only explainable reason for such evidence. It's up to the viewer to decide. On Saturday, October 15th of 2016, Cy celebrated his 16th birthday on an overnight investigation of Thornhaven Manor in Newcastle, Indiana. We had been to the manor on several different occasions and have never been disappointed in the activity we have experienced and been able to capture there. We did our first EVP session upstairs in the servants' quarters of the home and immediately started getting responses on audio recorders as well as other equipment we had set up in the room. Someone called out to Gabe Wyatt several times throughout this session, as well as others during the night. At one point, someone responded by setting off lights on the periscope when asked to do so. During this session, Gabe also experienced a feeling of someone touching or brushing his leg, and personally felt like there was a child's presence near him. His name continued to be called out during the night, and at one point much later, while doing another session downstairs, I asked if someone was near Gabe, and we all heard a very clear voice that said Lizzie. Lizzie was a two-year-old daughter of Simon Powell who had passed in the home. Was it Lizzie who had touched Gabe earlier in the evening? Was she trying to make contact with Gabe? Someone or something had definitely tried all evening to get his attention, and he had said earlier that he felt a child's presence around him on several different occasions. Our second and third sessions were done in the main hall or living room of the home, and were every bit as active as the first. Numerous voices and names came through on the audio, the entire time and there were again responses on other equipment as well. We all knew it had been a good night just by our own personal experiences as well as what we had heard during the EVP sessions so we were very excited to get started going through the audio after getting home. As usual I downloaded everything to my computer and quickly glanced through it all as I was unable to get to it till later. The next week I went back to start going through things and every bit of it was gone. Now this has happened many times with evidence gathered at the manor. Sometimes photos go missing, sometimes files on equipment have been corrupted or erased with no explanation. Usually it will mysteriously show back up sometime later, so I didn't panic, at least not at first. However, this time the old girl decided to keep it for pretty close to a year to the date before it just miraculously showed back up. We got probably 85% of it back everything but a very active session in the dining room that seemed to have struck a nerve with someone regarding Catherine Winters. When asked if there was anyone with us that knew anything about her or the photo I had laid on the table that was of Catherine, all the equipment went crazy and then shut down. 
every battery and every piece of equipment we had was dead. We did clearly hear with our own ears the same young girl's voice we had heard earlier reply yes before everything went crazy. None of the audio or video from that session was ever found again. Who knows, maybe the next time I check it, it will be back. We can only hope. We're here at Thornhaven Manor. This is Amber, Gabe, and Mike. On the second floor of our servants' quarters, we're going to try a spirit box session. We have a spirit box. We also have a periscope set up. We got a flashlight, and we've also got a mail meter going. Is there any person in this room that would like to make themselves be known to us? Can you please do so now by either making a noise, stating your name, moving an object, or can you touch one of us? We have spoke to you once before in the past. I'd like to know if you'd come out and say something to us again now. I've placed several objects on the floor. You may be able to make them uh, manipulate them. Was that? There's a round object in the center of the floor. If you were to walk up on that, you may be able to make that start lighting up. There's also a box with an antenna on it over by Gabe. If you were to walk up to that box, you might be able to make those lights light up. And there's a torch laying on the floor. Can you come forward again? We just want to speak with you. There's a cat that lives here now. Do you like the cat? See me? You mind me being here with you? Talking to you? If this is a servant's quarters, are there any servants still here? Can you say that again, please? We believe we've seen one of you walking across the screen some of the last times we were here. I'd really like to 
to speak with you. Just say Gabe. Gabe is one of our investigators. My name's Mike. I'm Amber. You know me. Barbara's downstairs. So you okay with that? If you're okay with that, can you walk past that round object that's in front of us and make the lights light up on it, please? It'd really be cool. Speak up again, please. Hello? Hello, I say. Are you nervous about us being here? Whoa. What does that mean? Wow. That was crazy. Did you just touch the gate? Something is rough for me, like. Like rough. Trying to show us that you're here? So are you in here with us right now? So you like Gabe? Do you remember him from the floor being here? We're getting a response on the periscope. Can you walk closer? Yes, that's it. Are you over there by gate? If you go really close to it, you can really make it light up. If 
you know who Gabe is, yes. Can you go over there by him? Can you point the light toward Gabe? There you go. Good. Yes, sir. Very impressive. We're getting response on the periscope. Can you walk closer? Yes, that's it. Are you over there by gate? If you go really close to it, you can really make it light up. I know you're in here. If you know who Gabe is, yes. Can you go over there by him? Can you point the light toward Gabe? There you go. Yes, sir. Very impressive. Thank you very much. Whoa, baby. Whoa. Can you tell us your name? Whoever is touching the end of the day, please? I'm so sound like a voice. Yeah, it sounded like it was right here in the room. Are you trying to speak with us? I think we heard you talking. Was you trying to tell us something? Can you say that again, please? Are you still in here with us, please? Hello? Who are you? You sound different than the person was talking with before. Who are you? whatever you say. Do you trust us? Do you know why we're here? Can you come back one more time, please? That was me. Can you please come back one more time? Still able to talk to you.
Okay, well, if you're not going to come back and speak with us, thank you. That was me. That was me sliding in the chair.
Do you like this cat? Is this your cat? Here. Is Catherine still here? 
still around here? Does she go to the desert sometimes?
Are there ghosts here? <coughs> Are there any spirits here? In this room? Spirits are here.
Thank you. Can you sit on the round for it, Bob? Please? Keeps wanting to talk to Gabe. He's still here. Just went straight to that box. Can you do that? Or would you do that? Can you walk over to the TV?
Anybody still here? Hello? People that were in here earlier are still here? question about this picture on the table. Someone said yes, they could tell me who it was. The camera went down. The mail meter went off. I think we're back up and running. I'm going to ask again. I've laid a picture on the table. Is there anybody here that can tell me who this is? Who the picture is of? Where'd everybody go? Anybody down here at all with us? Let's talk to us. We know you're here. You shut everything down. You were playing with the periscope for a few minutes.
Everybody got off the quiet. Someone just join us. Well, I can't hear you. You're mumbling. Sorry. Something like, I feel like uh, something's walked right up on me. I'm basically standing right next to me. Unless you remove your feet. Hmm. Is you moving your feet? Something like really. Somebody over by Gabe. I heard the little girl's voice a while ago. Perfect, but I am that's about all I've caught. Catherine, are you here? It's Barb and Amber and Gabe. You know us. If you're here, please come through and talk to us. We're going to move on to a different room if nobody wants to talk to us down here.